Health Week, which reminds us that there was no new money in the budget for Indigenous mental health, and that last week this government was castigated by the Human Rights Tribunal for their failure to act on Jordan's principle. And in Attawapiskat, the suicide crisis continues with young people being medevaced out. Now, this community has been asking for a long-term child mental health worker. Some of these children traumatized are as young as six years old, so I'm asking this minister, what is her commitment to get long-term mental health services on the ground for that community and for those children? Well done. The Honourable Minister of Health. Mr. Speaker, I thank the member opposite for his, his question and for his relentless advocacy on behalf of communities like Attawapiskat that are in his, his riding. I find that the news out of a community like Ab Attawapiskat is devastating. It's almost incomprehensible that children at such a young age could find that life has no hope left for them. I am working, the Health Canada is working along with the Government of Ontario, along with the uh, Anishinaabe Aski Nation and the Winnebago Area Health Authority to find long-term funding solutions to increase capacity in those communities. The Honourable Member